we have a YouTube premiere, and if you guys haven't seen it already, you guys can actually head on over there. We will have the link. She's testing the security limits of it. She's yeah. like over here, too strong. Center is the weakest point. Okay, so my issue is, I came in, the door slammed behind me. back at it while I am as you guys saw I was uh, out of it for a couple of days I'm still you know getting back into it but wait till tomorrow guys because we have something for you what is it Paul we have a YouTube premiere and if you guys haven't seen it already you guys can actually head on over there we will have the link It's going live again Friday at 12 p.m. it's a big announcement that's why we're doing another YouTube premiere something that we have been working on for quite some time and it's going to be a lot, a lot of fun. We are expanding our our channel. It's going to be awesome. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. What? Didn't you just release merch? That is what is happening, guys. We are doing a lot of new things, different things. So always come back and check it out. Now, don't forget to also check out our merch store. We do have tons and tons of designs, lots of cool stuff. We are also donating the proceeds of some of our select items to charity. So these are definitely something that we're just trying to spread as much awareness as possible. If you want to help the channel, that's a great way. Plus, you get some awesome merch like this blanket. Oh, look at you see Orion's tongue right there. So in the description below, you will find the link to the merch store. So guys, today's vlog is going to be slightly different, but something that's also similar. We're going to do another reaction video to some, again, footage that never made it on YouTube. But here's the difference though. We have both of us now, yes. Now guys, just to let you know, these reaction vlogs still kind of have a theme to go that goes with it. Yes. Last reaction vlog was about doctors. Mm -hmm. This one's all about our pups. So enjoy the behind the scenes exclusive looks. Oh my God, guys. I think you guys are gonna find this clip funny and hilarious. I say that now, but it isn't. Orion's enjoying himself. So I was going on a walk with Orion. We are in Paul's grandmother's neighborhood, just taking a chill. Paul's showing off a property. And I decided to take Orion out. While I took him out, I was like, oh, there's a tennis court here, you know. Whatever, let, let's go check it out. Like, I didn't mean to do anything wrong. We're not doing anything wrong. I feel like a lot of people are gonna be like, why are you in the tennis court? I just never came in here and I wanted to come in here. You know, it doesn't say no pets allowed in here. This is what the sign says. No skateboarding, bike, rollerblading, all that. Funny thing guys, Paul has never saw some of these clips and this is no. something he has not seen. <laughs> she told me about it, but I haven't seen any of this and honestly, I am laughing. All right, so let's keep this going so you guys can understand what happened towards the end. Orion. When we came in here, he was super excited. Look like at that. He's addicted to this spot right now because he sees a freaking ball. If you guys don't see the ball, I don't know what to tell you. Orion, I'm not getting you that ball. Like, I'm not climbing over this fence to get on that ball. And it's a stranger's ball, so I'm not touching it. He is deaf staring it down. Look at that. I don't have my camera, so it's great that I have my phone. Oh, wait, I thought that was Paul. Paul's right there. <laughs> Paul, he still hasn't left. Okay, so my issue is... I came in, the door slammed behind me. Wait, wait, oh, I got out! Oh my God, I thought it was stuck for a second. Guys, it was not letting me out. So I had to like really push hard to get out. Oh my God. These are the moments I go through. Orion's coming now. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, get back in there, get in there. So we do have a unique thing with Orion. Whenever there's a door of any sort, any doorway threshold, he knows he needs to wait for permission. Him running out like that? No, you don't do that, see? See that? Now he's ready. Okay, close, finish. And let's not slam this dang door. So no one else gets stuck in there. I made it out, guys. Now it didn't seem like I put a lot of pressure behind that door. Guys, I put my full weight which is a lot ish i've actually seen people like blocking the door so it doesn't close like with bottles and bags and stuff so i do believe her like that is 100 uh -huh. true that you will get stuck in there so would, it, would you have rescued me 
I would have drove by. Ha! Loser! I didn't scream for Paul's name at the time because he was showing off a property, so... Uh, oh, if you scream my name, I'm dropping everything and sprinting like hell and see what the hell happened. <laughs> He's going to see me like behind a like, gate like, are you okay? That's fine, but I didn't want to, you know, make him look unprofessional, unprofessional with my care. stupidity. <laughs> I don't care. My wife is more important to me than anything else. So while Janice is holding Yodi... She does this. She does this where, like, when Janice goes to give her a kiss, she, like, subtly, like, moves her head in. I don't know what she's doing. Ah! I'm adding so much pressure. Yep, see right there? Just that subtle little movement. <laughs> oh, my pink belly. I love you. You know what I mean? She's just like she's a like, sweetheart. Just give me love. That's all I want. Thank you. Okay, she's on top of my lip. I'm not leaning into her. Now, I feel like these clips are important because I don't feel like we truly depict Yori's personality. I feel Not like she, fully. I feel like she comes off on the vlogs like a blob. Like, yeah. she's just furniture. She's just there. Yeah, yeah, no, she has a lot of personality. She has a lot of attitude as well. She truly does. And uh, we do not depict her enough because she's not really in the vlogs enough. Everyone yeah. knows Orion. No one really knows like, Yodi. Orion is the crazy fun one that if you want to be goofy, he's the dog to do it with. And then Yodi is the one who's chill, mellow. You know, you have a glass of wine with her and she'll be drinking that wine with you, enjoying a good soap opera kind of a dog. Still to this day, there is not a single person who has met Yodi and goes, I don't like her. Yes. Not one person has ever said that. And people who are not dog, dog people lovers, yeah. go, I love her. So in this clip, you kind of see her love for us. It doesn't show, but she has her moments. She's like not a cat, but then she's like a cat. Like she has that chill, mellow personality she's of a cat. She's there, I love you, but give me love. Yeah, but it's like, I don't know. It's just right for us. It is. It's, like, perfect. it's perfect. We love it. So now you guys are about to see a little bit of Yodi's sassy side. Mm-hmm. She got attitude, I'm telling you. Yeah, she just did it. She like sticks, she stuck her head. She got like up to her shoulders. Look, 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 look. She'll get her head like all the way up to the bottom of her neck through. I have a recording of it. <laughs> now, something you guys do see. There is stuff Orion will never do that Yori does, and Yori does not give a crap. Nope. She is truly not trained. She don't care. She, no, she does not care. Like, she has no boundaries. And if you try to place some boundaries on her, <laughs> she's the dog that's gonna look at you and be like, no, nah, not for me. This is not happening. I was recording vertically. That's a mob B, okay? Because I was thinking this was gonna go on Instagram and not YouTube. That's perfectly fine. Yori is one of those that she will not back down from a challenge. She sees a gate, she goes, <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> She has no shame. She knows the weak point. Look, she's going to get through. If she went through like the gap, I think she would. And she knows it. Oh my god. She's testing the security limits of it. She's like over here, too strong. Center's the weakest point. If I calculate the force of newtons and weight that I have to push into it, maybe I can... Alright, let's see, right here's the weakest point.
Oh, bitch. So as you can tell, Yodi is like the Velociraptors in Jurassic Park. She is testing the security <laughs> point. She is testing the security to see what is the weakest point in the entire gate. She found it. And as you guys saw, Orion was not instigating. He was not doing a thing. Wow, she had all the audacity and be like, I have all the right. Yep, she doesn't care. Me and Janice were both standing there. She's like, I don't care. She doesn't care. Orion would never do that, but. Yeah, Orion was in the back. He was just sitting there like, what do I do? Can I, can I go over? But I feel like Orion lets her do what she does. So he can have an excuse to just follow behind her. She's her the mastermind and he's just like, I'm following you. Pretty much. And then like when we open the gate, Yodi's like, oh, it is. Opens it up, walks on in, and then Orion just sits there like, wait, what? So as you guys saw, Yodi has her sweet, delicate side that she asks for love and cuddles. And oh love my it. gosh, it's like the sweetest thing on this earth. Yeah. And then you have these sides of her that you can't leave her alone. <laughs> if she's alone in the kitchen, she finds something to eat. It's insane. So that's why we actually have a gate. A lot of you guys think it's for Orion's sake. No. No, it's, it's actually for Yodi. Yeah, it's for her. So we had a few sacks of like dry kibble food that we never opened, we never used, and that we were going to donate to the local animal shelter. We left it underneath our bed of our guest bedroom. And we left for a few hours to go run some errands. I don't even remember what but Yori was riding around the house. She was free to roam. She pushed open the guest bedroom door, which we closed it, but it didn't latch completely yeah. closed. So she pushed it open. It was a bag inside of a box. She found the box, and this is like a 40 pound sack. Yeah, I was gonna say, okay. it's not, it was not light, not it was heavy. Like a 40 pound sack. She's like, what, nine pounds? Max 10. 10 on a fat day. She was able to remove this bat, this box from underneath the bed. She pulled it out. Ripped open a huge portion of the cardboard box. Yep. Got to the bag, yes. ripped open the bag, and started eating kibble. <laughs> she was so fat. She had no regrets. <laughs> we came home, her stomach was full, the, uh... and she was like, sup. <laughs> She did not care whatsoever. Honestly, guys, I love having a well-trained dog. And I kind of like having a not-so-well-trained dog. A mischievous one. If they're a decent size, because I can't imagine all the stuff or Yori does <gasps> being Orion's size. You know that, what I mean? That video you showed me, the dog's destroying the couch. Like, I couldn't imagine. At least Yori isn't like a smaller scale that we can handle, but if it was a bigger dog, no. Yep. That's why now when we leave, we put her in her crate. Yes. Which she actually we does learned. Like. We yes. learned. So when it comes down to us with Ren and Yori, we have the best of both worlds. You know, when we want to have fun, energetic, run around, we have Orion, who's lots of fun and happy and furball. And then we have Yori, who's just cuddly, sweet, and just perfect on a rust day or a mental health day. She's just there by your side, which is awesome. So guys, I hope you enjoyed today's reaction vlog with both Janice and I today. I hope it gave you a little bit more insight into what it is to have both Orion and Yori. Because, again, not many people really know much about Yodi, and I hope you truly were able to see her kind, cute, and cuddly and mischievous side as mm -hmm. well. Guys, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. It truly means a lot to us because we just want to spread as much awareness as possible. We want to do these fun vlogs for you guys, do YouTube premieres, do all kinds of stuff. And... When you like, share, and subscribe, it really does help us. It supports the channel, and we see the subscriber count. It's going up consistently each and every day. So genuinely, thank you guys. It really, really means a lot to us. In the description below, you will find Orion's Instagram link, as well as our Patreon. Instagram, so you can see Orion's journey of service dog train yeah. from when he was a wee little pup up until today. We do post a lot on there as well. We also have Patreon. Patreon is another platform where we give exclusive behind the scenes content, exclusive Patreon only vlogs, early access to certain vlogs like the Chronic Illness series, as well as we do one-on-one -on -one Skype sessions with us, the Raw Life family. So if that's something you're interested in, guys, check the description below. So guys, do not forget, the biggest thing is we have another YouTube premiere tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, noon Eastern Standard Time, guys is the next premiere. It's gonna be awesome. 
we are expanding our channel and I think a lot of you are gonna love it and this is going to again open new doors for us and for everybody so we can expand the raw life community and the fun thing after tomorrow's premiere there's gonna be an after party yeah <laughs> We'll explain more tomorrow. So guys, that is it for today. We are gonna take it easy. We hope we were able to give you more of an inside look of our pups. They're part of our family too, and they're important to us as well. They are the family. So guys, for now, until tomorrow, adieu and good night.